no, no, no. Ah! Hey guys, so let me tell you what happened last week. So I was on my computer and I was drinking some water, you know, doing homework, good things, and then splat. I get water on my computer. And not just like a little water that's like on the little silver part. No, I got it on my mouse pad. So that water just started slowly seeping in and that's when my heart sank. I knew my computer was getting water damaged. I was so scared. I was like, are you kidding me? My computer is gonna die on me right now. So of course I go to the internet and I look up how to save a computer from water damage. Cause my computer was dying and literally was calling my name. It was like, Please, 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 please. guess what I found? Nothing. I was like, wow, okay. Um, I guess no one can relate to me at all. I'm just gonna make a video on it so people like me don't have to go through all these weird videos telling you like, technical things because I don't speak that language, sorry. I'm sure there's people who do understand what they're saying, but I don't. So, first thing is first, make sure you're safe. If it does have a lot of water in it, then I don't think you're gonna be able to save your files, but unplug all things because you don't wanna get electrocuted or anything because that would be bad. Make sure all the charges are plugged out of it, all of the charges for your phone, charger for the computer, everything's plugged out. Next thing is turn off your computer. If you see that your computer is gonna have some water damage, turn it off immediately. If you see that it's getting inside the little holes of your keyboard, turn the computer upside down because when you turn it upside down, it gets all that water out and the water's going that way. Turn the computer upside down so all the water can seep out without getting into the technical things in the letters. Then you need to dry up all surfaces that you see water dried all good as much as you can because you do not want it to go inside your child. Inside the crevices, get every little thing. And then I found this weird trick to help your computer dry off. I'm not 100% sure it's gonna work, but it can work. Picture right here. You can pause, take a screenshot, I'll pose. It's basically just having a fan underneath the crate, having a cotton towel over the crate, and the computer flip down on, you, you know, you get it? You kind of get it? Yeah. It's best to use a cotton towel because it's really absorbent, or you can just use paper towels because those are good too, but, you know, cotton towel, number one choice. Next is gonna be kind of hard to do, but it's really worth it. Turn off your computer for about 96 hours. It takes long for the liquid to dry on your computer, so be patient. If all else fails, then you kinda gotta go to the Apple store. But if these tricks don't work, I mean, you could try the rice trick. Oh, sorry, just waiting for my glow up. You know, I've never had Mountain Dew before. New thing, I don't know. Oh my god. <coughs> it's really good. Um, but yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And yeah, okay, bye.